How's it going guys? Welcome back to uh, Booga Booga. Today we are playing a game called Booga Booga C2. Now this was actually made and published by Soybean. Um, and I, this, was, this was recommended to me to play by Dotsy, one of my fans. And the first thing I'm noticing is I apparently already have things, which is really strange. But also my player model is my actual Roblox player model. Oh, okay, I guess now it's not. That's weird, now that I teleported to, like, actually this place. Okay, weird. Okay, let's go to the ice biome. Now, the game description says that the game is incredibly massive and is exclusive to PC. And even on PC, it's gonna take a bit to load. So the armor system and the bag system also is really different. As you can see, it's not like a typical booga, um, where you only have one thing of armor rather than three separate pieces. And things have durability. I don't know why my bag has durability. It's pretty strange. And you start with steel, and you click on things to pick them up. Which is very strange, but I wanted to test this game out just because one, one of my fans did suggest it. So, yeah, why not, right? Holy crap, though. He was not, um, misadvertising the game. This is really big. So, 20 damage, steal things do. And you click to pick up, which, again, I don't know how much I like that, but, I mean, I guess maybe I'll get used to it. Alright, uh, can I make a, a raft? Oh my god, why is this thing craft big raft? Oh, man, what the heck? Invalid placement, find an open area. Excuse me? What about this is not open? Okay, well, I guess I can't place my raft, so that was kind of a waste of stuff. Whoa, these oceans are deep. Holy crap. I wonder what, like, the actual point is. I know Soybean, in the later stages of Booga development, he started going balls to the wall with the whole ocean thing. I don't know if he ever did anything cool with it, but, I mean, it exists, right? Not gonna lie, I kind of like the trees. They're, they're kind of nice, but this map is big. Oh my lord. Wow, if this video does good, I might make a second one on this game because there really is quite a bit to explore by the looks of things. Also, I have I have 16 clubs. <laughs> I don't know why I got 16 clubs, but I do uh, 5 damage. You've been combat tagged, don't leave the game. Combat tagged by who? A fucking Banto? Also, why can't I swing my weapon anymore? Oh, okay. I guess if you get hit, you have to de-equip your weapon uh, and then re-equip it. That's kind of strange. Now, on Roblox, this game only has 12,000 visits. Yeah, wait, why is the thing so buggy? Okay, I'm starting to see why this game only has 12,000 visits. Uh, to put that into perspective... Oh, sorry, I actually, I lied. It has 19,000 visits. But to put into perspective my game, Booga Booga Revive, which was not very popular, but my game, my game got 30,000. So this game was apparently so bad and so underplayed that it got only two thirds of the plays as my game, which is, uh, <laughs> kind of crazy. Um, let's go break these snowmen. That's kind of cool. There's snowmen in this game. Okay, yeah, let's, let's go fuck them up. Come here, buddy. Chill man. Oh, okay. He's not a snowman. He's a chill man. I guess the word snowman was copyrighted. He drops two wood and one ice. Wait, let, let me let me run that back. What the heck? One wood and two ice. Okay, that's very interesting drops. Is this crystal? Oh, it's ice. It just looks crystal-y. Okay, that's six ice. Cool. Let's fight the barbarians. Oh, okay. The barbarian doesn't actually drop. <laughs> this game is goofy. Man, I'm, not, I'm definitely understanding why it doesn't have any plays. Not to be hateful or anything, but like, just like, what the fuck? Why is the water so low in this river? It's like so deep, you'd, you'd be like stuck if you fell in. Okay, what kind of tools can I make? Do you just- is there no leveling in this game? Like you can't level up? Like you just start with the ability to craft everything? Um, steel, let's see, uh, wood. Okay, so you can make wood stuff, so if these things do run out, run out of durability, it's not like I'm gonna be screwed. Okay, that's good at least, let's see, a small tropical tree. To me, that does not look pretty small. That looks pretty damn big. And it also doesn't look tropical. And why is there tropical trees in the middle of an ice biome? <laughs> this is very goofy, not gonna lie. 
All right, well, that's a ton of wood and logs, I guess. So yeah, I guess log and wood are two separate things. Wait, do things- Wait, there's a maximum stack size of 16. Wait, that's kind of crazy. So you can't have more than 16 of anything. Huh, that is quite an interesting game mechanic, not gonna lie. What are these little- Oh, those- are these frozen pumpkins that you can't harvest? Okay, cool. Oh, look at this- Yucky brown water. Ew, bro, disgusting. I wonder if everybody spawns with all of the, this crap, or if, uh, get it by default. Wait, what? Oh, wait, so if you want to make a stone pick, you have to first make a wood one, and then use stone with the wood pick to make a stone pick, and then if you want to make an iron pick, you have to- wait, what? Okay, so an iron pick, you don't have to do that whole bull crap. But you do need three cooked iron, so I don't know how to get iron, but maybe I should try looking around, I guess? What's this big M thing? If I press M, from soybean, greetings, ha uh oh one one A lot has changed since the last version, you probably have many questions. Um, not really. Your new shop is awesome, is it really awesome? Uh, Game Pass, skins. Oh god, is this Booga Booga reborn? They have skins. Ooh. Oh, hey, I found the giant. I wonder if I free him, is he actually gonna, like, get freed? Or is he just gonna disappear like the barbarians did? Eh, coal is kinda cool, though. I do kinda need cloud berries, because I don't think I found any food at all yet. Those are some big cloud berries, holy. Oh, yeah, let's... Let's, oh, that's 5k HP. I right, wait quickly. Let me just go get these cloud berries and then let's break him and see if he actually spawns. And if he does, let's just hope to God that he doesn't absolutely kill me. Because he probably will. Oh, my iron uh, axe broke. Okay, well, let's make a wood one. Boom. And then let's craft that into a stone one. Uh, yeah, there you go. Yay. I like how it explodes into like a bunch of pieces of wood when you break your pick or you break your axe it's kind of strange but i kind of like it all right well let's let's break the giant let's die oh my my iron thing broke oh it gives you your wait what it gives you the iron back but like what's the point then what's the point of having durability if it just gives you it back i feel like that's kind of strange but let's use the stone one which does 15 damage i mean i may as well use it since i crafted it and i bet if i auto clicked this would go, like, really quick. Like, let's see. Oh, yeah, like, this is really quick. All right, let's just break this freak. All right, well, my, uh, my stone pick broke. Oh, wait, you can just punch things and do damage by punching things? Oh, okay, that's kind of cool, I guess. Well, let's just make a new iron pick. I mean, who really cares? It's not like I'm gonna actually play this game, so I don't think I need to conserve resources. I mean, well, I don't even know, like, there doesn't seem to be any caves on this biome, which is pretty poor game design, in my opinion, but... Maybe I'll find a cave. I mean, maybe that's a cave. I can just go in and get some iron really quick, but that's not really important. The frozen giant is broken now. Okay, yeah, he doesn't even exist. <laughs> uh, soybean. This is why we love you. Such an amazing dev. How do I eat? Just like, yum, yum, yum. Oh, here we go. Cool. It gives the little effect, too. Yeah, we'll just take my 16 tiki torches. You don't actually have to place them. You can just carry them. Um, any, any resources? Oh, hey, look. Okay, wait, can I place this? Invalid placement. Okay, I think- I'm pretty sure every placement is invalid, I- I think. Why do I still have those HP effects sparkling over me? I think- I think that's just permanent. Oh, it's because I'm overhealing, that's why. Oh, okay, I understand. Do I have to make a tribe to place things, maybe? Like, what if I put down my tribe totem? Do it- there isn't even a tribe totem? Okay. <laughs> okay, pretty strange if you ask me. Uh, take the raw iron. Oh, you get three each. Pretty cool. I thought it would be like one or some goofy stuff. All right. And that is this one done. Let's get my tiki torch out so I can see. Right. Well, I pretty much have access to as much iron as I'm ever going to need. I feel like the sound you make when walking does not at all suit the way that I'm actually walking. Okay, so that's silver. And this is gold. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna need any of that really quick. So let's just leave and let's maybe go check out one of the floating islands. I think that's a great thing to do. Whenever you whenever you try out a new Booga game, a pretty good way of knowing whether or not it's a good game is by checking out the floating islands. Like usually it's pretty telling whether or not you're playing a bad game if the floating islands are bad. So let's see where's the closest one okay so it looks like we have the traditional three although it seems like there's also a fourth we have the feather island i'm assuming 
Sun Island, and we have, I'm assuming that's the Lonely Guard Island, so. Yeah, let's just head on over and see what that's all about. As a matter of fact, because you can swim in this version of the game, I bet I wouldn't even have to, like, do any fancy shit. I bet I could f swim up that waterfall to get to that island. So let let's do this one first, and then go to the other ones. I think that might be a bit better. Also, what in Tarnation is this? Um, is this a... <laughs> This is a baby snow mammoth. Okay, the head is absolutely detached. The head got decapitated. The body is floating and all of the legs do not exist at all. All right, well, let's just beat him up, I guess. Yeah, the baby snow mammoth's head being detached is really strange. I don't know why it's detached and why he has no legs, but that's kind of scary. I'm actually not going to beat him up, though. I mean, well, I guess I did beat him up, but I'm not going to kill him. That's a bit toxic, isn't it? Sorry, Mama Mammoth, your baby is a bit decapitated and dilapidated, both at the very same time. Ooh, is that music? Ooh, Booga has background music now, that's cool. Let's go swimming. Ooh, seaweed and sharks. Ew. Oh shit. Oh shit, he's coming for me. He's coming for me. Do you want the smoke? Do you want the smoke, buddy? Hmm? Oh shit, he did like 20 damage. Quick! Beat him up! Beat him up! Ugh. Oh wait, he's actually kind of lighting me up. He's kind—he's kind of—he's kind of like fucking me up, actually. Oh god, he's actually fucking me up really bad. Swim! Huh. I have like no HP. Oh, I died, bruh. And everything is gone. Oh, that's crazy. That's actually crazy. I just died and lost everything. And booga booga. C point C two or whatever it's called. Oh, but I have my armor in my bag still. Okay, that's cool. Um, okay. I don't even know where the hell I am. You know, that probably could have been avoided if I just made a raft, although you, you kind of can't make rafts, so... Yeah, holy crap, it's really dark out. I can't see a damn thing. Uh, well, let's make... I don't even know. I mean, I kind of want to make a campfire, but I don't think I can. Because if I try to place it... Oh, wait, you can. Okay. Uh, how do you fuel it? Do I just put, like, what? Oh, there you go. Okay. Wait, if I- so wait, do I have to do this then? This item cannot be convert- inserted into a campfire. Okay, so... How do I cook anything? Do I drop it? Like in standard Booga? No. Um... I don't know if soybean thought this far. Okay, smelter. It seems there's no smelter. Forge. Oh, so there is a forge. It just costs 12 stone, okay. Uh, whoops, okay, I did not mean to drop that. So 12 stone, okay, well, I'm not gonna worry about that too much. You know what, I think this is a great time to end the video, seeing as there's not much left to do. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I would, you know, flip the camera around to my face, but you, you kinda can't. So we're just gonna, you're just gonna have to look at the back of my head while I do the outro. Thank you guys <laughs> so much for watching. If you wanna see another video on this game, let me know in the comments. But until next time, stay awesome. And, uh, peace out.